Hello again, my dear Bloomfield family and friends. You know, I thought about not actually doing a video this week. This has been a really, really rough week for me. Uh, some of you may have received my email yesterday uh, where I expressed um, extreme grief and loss related to one of our students who recently passed away. Uh, this particular student I would sit in the cafeteria with and have lunch with uh, periodically. And uh, he was just a bright light that was supposed to graduate in May. And in speaking with his mother um, again and just, just talking about his life and his life of commitment, uh, he was a healthcare worker. And I just wanted to make sure that he was remembered. This is a special week for so many of you, whether we're dealing with Passover or Easter and all the activities that typically go on during this week. Uh, I could not just um, not take some time to visit with you. You know, as we look at all the loss and we talk about all of the stages uh, that are part of grief, whether we're dealing with denial or anger or bargaining or depression uh, or any of that, uh, and finally getting to that final stage of acceptance, it's a process. Uh, it's a process that I want you to know that there are resources out there for you. Uh, we're here for you that there are all types of loss right now that are going on. Of course, we have the physical loss of death of someone that we may know, whether it's a family member or friend. We have psychological losses. We have um, our freedom. Um, again, right now, we're feeling that as a loss. But we have resources. You know, there there is light uh, to, to, to chase away this darkness. So as we go into this week and we try to spend time with each other, uh, look for ways that can help you move beyond the loss. Stay healthy, get exercise, uh, learn to relax. I've got to learn to step away from the computer um, and, and find ways to kind of get away from the digital medium that we've been using. Um, you need to find out what works for you. We need you. We love you. And again, remember that we're here for you. You take care and have a great week.